Rankin Jordan Pediatric Bridge Hospital has a completely different approach to healing. They want their patients to play as much as possible. In fact, they have a team of employees who have the best jobs in the world. They actually get to play with the kids. This next segment has been sponsored by Rankin Jordan Pediatric Bridge Hospital. And joining me this afternoon is Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Nick Holcamp. Doc, welcome back to the show. Thanks very much for having me. Of course, and for those who are not actually familiar with Rankin Jordan, what makes your hospital so special? Well, we're a bridge hospital, bridging the gap from the acute care hospital to home for children with complex medical conditions after bad accidents, illnesses, uh, severe prematurity, things that need more time and attention than can happen at home, but they're better served at a playful setting like Rankin Jordan. I actually love that. I mean, truly bridging the gap for those kids. And like you said, a playful setting. Why do you think play is so important to a child's healing process? Well, as a pediatrician, I think play is the central therapeutic element, is the, the essential piece of uh, what a child has to do every day to get better, bigger, stronger, more socialized, uh, better integrated into their family and community. Without play, uh, there's not much progress. And unfortunately, there's not much play in hospitals, in other hospitals. No, exactly. A lot at Rankin Jordan. <laughs> and that's what we love about Rankin Jordan. I mean, I think it really does speak to all of the things that kids need to grow and to develop. And you guys have actually done some pretty important research. Tell me a little bit more about that. Yeah, that's exciting. So we just wanted to know where are kids and what are they doing in our hospital, thinking we were getting kids up and out a lot, and we are compared to other hospitals, but we realized through the study that we could do more. That was the stimulus behind developing the Oz program, the optimization zone, and more recently uh, bringing on patient play associates, basically paid positions to play in, in developmentally appropriate and stimulating ways with kids who uh, would otherwise be sitting in bed and doing just about nothing. That is pretty incredible. I mean, just having that focus on play does so much for all of your patients. Absolutely. They get all the medical attention they need and, and support and therapy. That's essential for the recovery from whatever brought them there in the first place. But the thing that takes them to the next level and gets them better, faster, and get them home sooner is, is the playfulness. Oh, that drinks so much joy to my heart and almost tears to my eyes. It's like, Liz, if you're at home, you're watching, and you might be interested in maybe supporting Rankin Jordan, Dr. Holcamp, what are some ways that people can get involved with you guys at the hospital? Well, um, most everything is accessible through the website, rankinjordan.org, and you can donate there. You can learn how to volunteer at Rankin Jordan through the website. We have a blog uh, that I write monthly just to update folks on what's going on. There are events coming up. We have a, a golf event this year at Top Golf that's uh, for the community to join us and celebrate what we're doing there. So lots of ways to get involved. I love that. Well, St. Louis, if you're at home and you're watching and you'd like to become involved, you absolutely can. You heard Dr. Holcamp. All you have to do is head online to their website. There's community events and blog posts you can read and actually hear and see first experience what's going on at Rankin Jordan from Dr. Holcamp himself. Check it out. It's pretty incredible. You can also head online to their website, rankinjordan.org. Follow them on Facebook, on Instagram, and on X. And we'll also make sure that you have access to all of these details on our website, studiostl.tv.